usuario que ves en pantalla ha publicado varios videos en los que prueba mediante sus propias grabaciones la existencia de lo paranormal y de los espíritus después de la muerte. Steve, como se llama, dice que desde que era un niño tiene estas experiencias y que diariamente lo sigue una docena de entidades a todas partes. En el siguiente clip, que es uno de tantos, nos muestra una de estas evidencias. And let me know that you need some kind of help. And that would be just by flying up towards me. Got somebody coming right here. Hi, Spirit. I'm going to try to help you, okay? I'm going to do the best I can. Luego de que Steve invocara alguna presencia para manifestarse frente a su cámara, aparece este orbe justo en ese momento. Ahora, se podría decir que este orbe es muy diferente a lo que algunos podrían confundir como polvo flotando. Muchas personas de su audiencia quedaron impactadas. Sin embargo, en otro de sus tantos videos captó algo inquietante. Mientras Steve dormía en el sofá, una extraña voz escucha gritar, ¿por qué? En ese momento Steve recién se despertaba y no se había percatado del sonido, pero al parecer su perro sí lo había oído. El escalofriante sonido parece de una voz atormentada. Y estas son cosas que diariamente evidencia en su cuenta de TikTok. ¿Y tú? ¿Crees que todo esto puede ser prueba contundente de actividad paranormal? Déjame tu opinión en los comentarios. Jan, del canal Will Will Ghost Hunter, en esta ocasión se adentra a la conocida casa Boyd, o también conocida como The Boyd House. Narra la historia de una familia, la cual tuvo la gran cifra de 11 hijos, pero que cuatro de ellos fallecieron prematuramente. Además, la madre murió por un derrame cerebral y el esposo lo hizo pacíficamente por longevidad. Sin embargo, varios testimonios afirman que se escuchan golpes, extraños sonidos, entre otros avistamientos inexplicables. Pero sin duda, lo más inquietante es que dice haberse visto a la pareja de esposos aún deambular por la casa. Entonces, Jan completamente solo se dispone a investigar la actividad de esta propiedad. If you can hear me, could you make a sound somewhere in this house? It's awfully quiet in here to start. I'm not really feeling any. What the hell was that? Hello? Oh my god, that sounds like a woman's voice. I hear it through the headphones. Sounds like it's coming from in there. Minnie, was that you? Could you speak again? A disembodied voice emanates from the parlor room and sounds like it is saying. I'm not really feeling any. I'm not really feeling in. I'm not really feeling in. If you are indeed here and I'm not going crazy, could you touch this green light that's on the table? You can use whatever energy you need. You can use energy from me, from my cameras. Oh. Okay. Wow. Okay, I'm getting chills suddenly. Is your name? Minnie Eckhart, are you still here? Are you still living in your home? If you are Minnie Eckhart, could you touch that green light again? Yeah, that's what I figured. Are you the voice that I heard earlier? Or was that somebody else? Was that voice you? Yes. Minnie, is it okay if I ask you a few questions? Yes. Okay. My first question, Minnie, is are you aware that you have passed away? You're no longer living. Whoa. Okay. So then, why do you stay here? Why don't you pass on to the next life? Is there a next life? Yes. Okay, so then why are you still here? Are you stuck here? Or do you just like it here? 
Yes, okay. Well, I can definitely understand why. This is a lovely home. And you've lived here a long time, I understand. Is Fred... Okay, whoa. I heard that. Minnie, was that you? Did you just make a sound? It's like a tap on a wall. If that was you, could you... Okay. Oh. I heard that. That was right behind me. Thank you. Alright, Minnie, I'm hearing you all around me right now. What? What is that? Oh my god! What the hell? That's like a radio! But how? I am spooked by an old radio turning on by itself. You can actually hear the knob twisting as it is being activated. What? What? It sounds like it's changing stations. It's still on, but it's not making noise. Oh my god, the stack's coming in more. Hello? Oh! Oh! A voice just came through! What the hell is going on? Hello? Could you speak again? Unbelievably, a ghostly woman's voice breaks through the radio static. Was this the spirit of Minnie Eckhart delivering a message from the other side? Las respuestas a través del medidor K2 fueron inmediatas y precisas, pero lo más escalofriante fue que además de prenderse la radio por sí sola, una voz al parecer femenina habla a través de la radio. Es como si intencionalmente hubiera encendido este medio para comunicarse. Ahora, ya han decidido investigar el sótano de la propiedad, y esto fue lo que pasó. Hello. Is anyone back here? Hello? The sound came from back over here. If that was you, could you make another sound? One creepy room. Who's down here with me? Oh, what the hell? Oh my god. What the fuck? <gasps> That's a tricycle! That's a tricycle! Oh my god! What the fuck? That's like up against the wall! Oh my god, that is terrifying. It must be like a child down here. Could you move that? Tricycle again? It was like right in the middle of the floor, I think. Because I remember bumping into it. I guess we'll go up to it. Hello? Something definitely would have had to have moved that tricycle. There is no way that would have done that by itself. I mean, just look. So you have to actually push this thing to get it to move. I mean, how do you explain that? <gasps> okay, that was a child's voice. Did you just speak? I'm freaking myself out now. Hello?
Amazingly, an intelligent voice of a little boy takes credit for moving the tricycle just moments ago. Ya, yeah. capta el escalofriante voz de un niño que parece atribuirse el haber movido el triciclo. La actividad en la propiedad solo parece aumentar cada vez más, a medida que avanza la investigación. Aunque aterrado, Jan está captando increíble evidencia de actividad paranormal en esta casa, pero aún faltaba mucho por recorrer. Atentos. Is there anybody upstairs? Oh my god, what the f is that? Dude, it's right there, it's like a shadow! I caught that in the photo! I managed to capture this photo of a dark humanoid mass standing at the top of the staircase. Notice how the figure is transparent and possesses non-physical qualities. Was this the spirit of Fred Eckhart staring me down from above? Fred, is that you? Are you watching me? I'm gonna go up there. I'm gonna go up there. Okay, Fred. I'm coming up. Oh, that was a loud thump up there. Is it okay for me to come up there? Guess I'll find out. Just breathe, just breathe. Hello? Are you up here? He would have been standing right here. Right at the top of this steps. I've got chills all over my body. I can barely take it. Una sombra oscura parece mirar a Jan desde arriba de las escaleras. Y, a pesar de encontrarse aterrado, sube para averiguar qué era. Y al no encontrar nada que pueda explicar este extraño fenómeno, decide ir a la habitación de Fred. Pero lo que captaría sería escalofriante. I just want to speak to you. That's it. I... My God, what the fuck? Those were footsteps. And they were walking towards here. You can clearly hear faint disembodied footsteps slowly making their way to the master bedroom. Fred, are you out there? I heard you walking. Did you walk up to this doorway? Are you somewhere in this room? Holy shit! Oh my god! Oh, okay. Holy moly! That was loud! That was like somebody just pounded on that door. Oh my god, I feel like he's getting like agitated with me. That did not sound friendly. All right, Fred, I'm gonna let you have this room back. I'm just gonna grab my camera, okay? I'm sorry, guys, I don't mean to retreat, but I just do not feel wanted in that room. What? No way, dude, that was the door. Oh, 
No! He just shut the door on me! How the f do you explain that? It is my belief that the shadow figure at the top of the stairs may have been Fred Eckhart himself, and this was his spirit escorting me out of his room. And I just do not feel wanted in that room. What? In that room. What? In that room. What? Jan es prácticamente expulsado de la habitación principal de la casa. El aparente espíritu de Fred era el mismo que se vio desde lo alto de las escaleras, que de alguna manera no parecía permitir que Jan permanezca allí. Ahora decide ir hacia el cuarto de los niños, en donde trataría de entablar comunicación con alguna entidad. Those toys back by that chair. Heck, you can even move this doll right here. Could you move that duck? What the heck was that? That was like a straight up music box. I don't know if I want to be in here anymore. Oh my God. Could you make that go off again? Whatever that was. Was that a music box? Oh my God. Holy moly, this is freaky. I want to see if I can find where that music box is. Is it over here? No, I don't see anything like that. I don't know what, what that came from. <gasps> Whoa. That was right here. Which one of them was it? Is it one of the dolls? What the heck? Oh my gosh. It was her. It was her. Holy crap. I found it. She's the one that's been going off. It's like a crank up doll. Oh my gosh. Now the question is, who the heck was making that go off? Don't tell me it was you. She looks suspicious. You know, I never actually went in here yet. <gasps> what the heck? I just heard like a... I just heard like a voice. Hello? A faint little girl's voice can be heard coming from the closet just as I am opening the door. That was like right when I opened this closet. Is there someone in here? I thought I may have heard someone. Ooh, it is cold in here. Holy. Is there somebody in here? Ooh, look at the chills in there. Something's weird about that closet for sure. I just captured this white mist-like form floating in the closet. Little did I know something quite shocking was about to occur. Oh, what the? What was that? What was in here? Hello? I feel like something's missing. Look it. <gasps> whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa! Dude! A freaking doll just got knocked over! Look it! Right there! Holy crap! Oh god, do I dare, dare grab it? Oh, of course I have to grab it. Ugh. Oh man. Oh, that's like a clown. Ooh, that's a creepy doll. I don't like that. He was like right there, wasn't he? I'm pretty sure he was. Did you just tip over that clown doll? 
Could you move him again? Although I did not capture the clown doll moving on video, I did snap this photo of it being dragged off of the shelf. What's even stranger is that this fog-like aura seems to be surrounding it. Could this be the spiritual energy of a ghost moving this doll? Luego de la inquietante experiencia, Jan decide volver a otra habitación del piso superior de la casa, en la cual ya es un cuadro que se dice está maldito. Entonces, trataría de volver a contactarse con alguna entidad en esa parte de la casa cuando algo captó su atención. Are you a human spirit? Are you a demon? What are you? I came from above. Are you upstairs? Hello? I don't want to cut this room short, but there's stuff going on up there. I don't know, I'm not really feeling much in here at the moment. If this painting is cursed and there is something attached to it, I'm not sensing it right now. That doesn't necessarily mean it's not true. Yeah, I better check out what's going on upstairs. Am I really gonna go up here? I have to. Hello? Here he goes. Who's up here? I heard somebody up here. Could you show yourself? Oh, I just seen something. I just saw like a light. I just saw like a glow. Holy. It was right, right over here. Just flying right by. I wonder if it's more children. I don't know. I just got that vibe for some reason. <gasps> There's another one. Holy. They're so quick. Oh. I seen you. Oh my god! Holy crap. That sounded like the window. Oh, that nearly gave me a heart attack. It sounded like a p -p 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 like a p -p -p on the window. But this is the third floor. So there's no way like somebody would be outside. It'd be impossible. Are you still up here? make that sound again? <gasps> okay. Thank you. I'm glad you're still up here. I'd hate to be alone. <gasps> what? Look! Dude, that thing was just moving! Oh my god! That rocky horse just moved! Could you move it again? Oh, dude, I think I might have caught that on camera. Oh my gosh, I did not expect that. Como si no fuera poco todo lo captado, ya logra filmar el caballito de madera moviéndose por sí solo, cuando en ese momento no había nadie más en el ático. Ni siquiera una brisa de aire podría explicar este extraño fenómeno. Durante toda la investigación, ya han captado impresionante actividad paranormal. Es como si la propiedad aún tuviera vida a pesar de estar vacía. Con ello, se confirman los diversos testimonios sobre la intensa manifestación sobrenatural en este lugar. ¿Y tú, te atreverías a pasar una noche en esta casa?
¿Qué minuto del video te pareció más impactante? Escribe tu opinión en los comentarios. Recuerda suscribirte al canal y activar la campana para no perderte ningún video. Un agradecimiento muy especial a los miembros de este canal. Esto es... Realidad Alterna.